Hello. Nice to hear. Cassette Beasts. This is a monster collecting RPG that I have already beaten off camera. But I unlocked some custom settings and I thought randomizing the monsters would be fun. And this is kind of a take two due to um, wanting to test the audio. So I already know what my starters are going to be with the seed I am going to use. But I think it'll be a fun seed to do. Um, but yeah, I'm randomizing the starter tapes, the partner tapes, and the monsters in each habitat. And I've selected the North American release date. I messed it up. Of Pokemon Red and Blue as the seed number. And of course, the best date format. Now rides this night through the realm into the wilderness of Wurrell. Few thereabouts that either God or other with good heart loved. Sir Gawain and the Green Knight, unknown author, 14th century. And we're off to a character customization screen. Um, uh, neat hair, hair color, you gotta have blue hair. I don't have a hair accessory. Uh, eye color, sure. Don't have a face accessory, and the more will be customizable later. And we can also revise everything that I just set. Okay, so we have a jump, we have a dash. Dashing takes stamina. We have a hundred wood, a basic recycled resource that can be exchanged for items and services. Off to the right, there was just a wall. We've got a locked gate here. We have a town over here. And there's a monster. <laughs> hey. hey, strangers, don't make any sudden moves. Craft crabs don't take kindly to strangers, or anyone for that matter. Here, take this. A cassette player. Might need that. In Cassette Beasts. Okay, quick question. What's your aesthetic? This would normally be a choice between... Uh, spooky or sweet, which would both be beast-type creatures that would evolve various ways later. Or rather, remaster. But for now... Uh, I don't know how good this thing is. This is one of the vanilla game's partner characters. I'm gonna yeah. go with this one. Kitelli. We see its bestiary entry. Its only way to communicate is through the static patterns on its television-like face. They're difficult to decipher, and this hurdle often prevents the common Kitelli from being able to connect with other creatures. All right, now pop that in your cassette player, put on the headphones, and press play. <laughs> this might get a little weird, but follow my lead. Your turn, don't be shy. Just breathe, y'all, just in a moment. Right. Right. Uh, gonna avoid a tutorial here, just for a moment. And the unknown person smacks the level one traffic crab. And we got three plastic. You handled yourself pretty well there. Uh, what's I'm your name? Kaylee. I'm Kaylee. Nice to make your acquaintance class here. Anyway, we should probably get you warmed up before you freeze to death in your pajamas. And you canonically being in your pajamas when you arrive is why I couldn't customize the clothes yet. <laughs> what do you think? Pretty quaint, right? What is this place? Welcome to Harbor Town. <laughs> Your new home. I already have a home. Oh, uh, right. Yes. Sorry. Not very good at this part. I don't know how best to break the news. You're stuck here. We all are. I don't feel so great. Wonderful. Ah, oh, wonderful. You're awake. Kaylee gave me quite a fright when she came knocking at my door. <sighs> Got me scared for a moment, Clyce here. I don't think it's anything serious. Transforming for the first time is quite a shock to the psyche. 
Anyway, Harbor Town happened to have a spare home available for you, so this is your place now. Where on earth is this place? On earth? On earth? Kaylee, you haven't told them? Sorry. Sorry, I should have. I mean, I collapsed right away. You didn't have a chance. You were trying to. Not to info dump on you, but you're on an island called New World. It's not strictly on Earth. At least that's what we think. Is there a way back home? I'm afraid not. I'm afraid not, Classier. I'm so sorry. Castaways have been trying to get back to their worlds for a century, and none have succeeded. <laughs> but you'll be okay. There's there's community in Harbor Town, and we help each other out. It's not a bad life. And it's safe. Apart from the monsters. Like the one yeah. from before. Yeah, I'm actually going on patrol soon. If you'd like to join me, meet me by the gate. The one just over the bridge we crossed to come into town. In the meantime, feel free to say hi to your new neighbors. Pretty sure word has gotten around already that there's a new face in town. We also fetched some clothes for you, though they might be a bit out of fashion for your era. Er, though, whatever. Uh, but it's all we have. Sorry, sorry, I'm info dumping. I'll catch you soon, right? We can talk more then if you'd like. Mm. My clinic is nearby. If you need a checkup, feel free to visit. This must all be a lot to take in, but we all went through the same thing once. New quest. This is the world we live in. And also, allegedly, this is the hand we're given. Um, Ranger Handbook. A handbook that Kaylee left for you. You can read this to review what you've learned about life on the island of New World. Except, um... That's full of lies? Go meet Kaylee east of Harbor Town first. Oh, a card fell out of the back of the handbook. Elemental type chart. It's it's an elemental type chart. So yeah, it only lets you review tutorials you've already seen, and we're barely into the tutorial. Anyway, it's time to get changed. It wouldn't let us leave the building if I didn't get changed. Um, I think the poncho looks all right. Uh, maybe the other way around. Aesthetic. <laughs> Alright. You know what I miss? Sports. Why can't Harbor Town start a football team? Well, I suppose there'd be no one to play against. I don't think the giant crabs on the beach have a competitive spirit. new here on the island? The look on your face gives it away. Huh? Have you been to the west side of Harbor Town yet? We've been meeting to vi visit the Heritage Center over there. Have you? <sighs> I was hoping to cross the bridge, but it's been raised for a while now. That's fine. I can stay on this side of town, I guess. Um, it's a box planter. Nothing's been planted here yet. Ranger notice board, join the rangers and complete your training to unlock access to these quests. This is actually like post game. It's just here. Town hall? Hello, sweetie. Yeah, if you're here to sign up with the rangers, you just missed Ianthe. She'll be at the outpost in the park. If you go north from the outskirts, you won't miss it. Does that book anything? No. Okay, he's not there yet up there. Eh, let's go to the the gate. That's enough being around town. Check out the Gramophone Cafe another time. Hey. Hey again, Kleiser. Are you feeling a little better? You know, you held your own the last time we fought together. So, well, I've been given an errand and need a helping hand. Do you think you'll be able to help me out? Sure. Glad to hear you're up to the task. Do you see the path there? Well... There was some kind of quake or monster activity last night. You can see the cracks in the ground. We're gonna check the path and make sure it's safe for crossing. Hmm. Here, take the key to the gate. Harbor Town Gate Key unlocks the Harbor Town Gate. Removed from inventory, Harbor Town Gate Key. Longest lived key in all of video games. Uh... 
Uh, right. Uh, there's some basics I gotta show you first. I hope you're ready to turn into a monster again. <laughs> Definitely. You'll adjust in no time. It's like riding a bike, except, you know, if the bike transformed into a cat with a broken television head. So I think, yeah, there's at least a little description written for every monster. <laughs> and also you're the bike. Hmm. See that creep with the boots? It's a spring heel, and it's gonna get aggressive with you if you get any closer. So you're gonna get closer, of course. All right. Level four, so shouldn't be much of a challenge. I'll just charge at it. And you'll smack. You've taken a bit of a beating, but your monster form can take it. The green bar represents your monster form's health, and the red is yours. If a form loses all of its health in a fight, its tape will break and need repairing. Not only that, but any extra damage from the attack that broke it will apply to your health, the red bar. If both of us lose all our health, then we'll have to retreat back to Harbor Town. Or if you run out of tapes. Got that? Yep. Right. Right, let's crack on. Zap. <laughs> Smack. Got him. The battle was won. We got a star, so we each learned a new move. Yeah! Nice work. Hmm, that elevator should be functioning. There's a switch around here to turn it back on. It's, a uh, right here. <laughs> hey! Great, let's head on up, shall we? I'll let you take the lead for any more fights, but don't worry, I'll be sticking with you from here on out. Achievement unlocked, Kaylee. Kaylee is now your partner. And she's got a dandelion. Dandelions are loyal defensive guardians. They're typically found standing at the entrances to important caves in the grassy plains of New Whirl. If you find one with no cave nearby, it may be a hint that something is hidden. Uh, except this is randomized, so it won't be a hint of anything at all. But we can look at our party. Uh, we can check both the human and the monster. The moves you have access to when using a tape in battle are determined by what stickers are attached to the tape. You can give new moves to a tape by applying stickers from your inventory. Moves you don't want can be peeled as stickers and put into your inventory. Stickers can be used as many times as you want, but can only be applied to a single tape at a time. Stickers can be obtained in a few ways. By filling tapes experience point bars from chests or caches you find, or from certain merchants in Harbor Town. Uh, so yeah, the the moves are very flexible. <laughs> um, although you can't just stick anything to anything. And also, all the partner characters will get a 10% boost to stats when transformed into their starting monster. For Kaylee, that would normally be um, Decibel and Sirenade, uh, but the other order. <laughs> uh, but she rolled a dandelion, which is a defensive plant monster. I probably won't stick with her because I don't really like dandelion that much. I prefer to be aggressive because when you expect hey. to win, aggression tends to resolve fights faster. <laughs> Do you need a break, Clysier? We can rest here if you'd like. These bonfire pits mark areas you're safe to set up camp. Gives you a chance to repair your tapes and heal up. Also, it's very cool seeing that uh, seal monster there. For reasons I'll explain later. Anyway, we'll rest. I'm missing about half my health from that spring heal, which is a guaranteed encounter even in randomizer, because uh, it's a tutorial battle. The two of you have fun throwing twigs into the campfire. It's nighttime now. There's a spooky monster down there. There'll be more monsters about, but we can take them. I haven't seen you around before. Let me guess, you washed up pretty recently, didn't you? Oh, is that a cassette player you're holding? Here, take these. Three rewinds. Fully restores the HP of one tape. Uses up turn one used in combat. Also, it's uh, literally a pencil. So you won't be able to get past there with all that air rushing. There, do you see that monster? There must be a way to get it to come over here. I will flip the switch. 
and it's a quest. Okay. Okay, take these. Pokeballs. I mean, cassette tapes. Records monster forms with a normal efficiency rate. There's something about the monsters on New World. Well. When weakened, their essence can be, well, recorded to cassette tapes. We don't entirely know how it works, but it does, and that's good enough for us. I am forced to record. And you'll smack. Pow. And it's guaranteed as long as you do an attack. We got Dominoth. They see themselves as defenders of peace and spend their days patrolling the skies of woodland areas. The only thing that can distract them from their noble duties are bright lights, such as lamps. Okay, whether recording succeeds or not is down to chance. However, several factors affect the probability of success. How much health the monster has, its level and rarity, how much damage you dealt to it while recording, and how much damage the person recording it took. Also, you'll notice I'm not in monster form while recording. You do take actual health damage if you get hit. Buffing your attacks or debuffing your target's defenses can be an effective way to increase the damage you deal to the target and improve the odds in your favor. As long as a monster is being recorded, it cannot flee or be defeated, so you don't need to worry about knocking it out. And those are its stats. It has the basic smack attack, which is wind, because um, multi-type stickers change to the type of the monster. And it has a speed buff. Now try switching to the tape you've just recorded. All right. And you'll just smack again. That's how you get yourself new monster forms. However, if a monster takes too much damage, it'll flee, so you won't be able to record it. You with me so far? Right. Now let's finish this bug off. Okay, and we got our first type interaction. A wind move hit a plant monster. Air type attacks can uproot plant type targets, disconnecting them from the source of their nutrients, the ground. Char and it inflicted AP drain, so characters with AP drain gain one fewer AP each round. I haven't talked about AP. It's the orange blocks. <laughs> this costs one, this costs zero. But I would like to deal damage. Uh, you naturally get 2 AP per round, and you get an extra AP if you land an effective hit. An effective hit is any that inflicts a debuff, except for the interaction of ice on water. The fl flinched doesn't count. Okay, Dominoth learned Zephyr, it costs 2 AP, it's a 60 power attack, and it's ranged. And for some reason, we're floating in the air. <laughs> this is meant to happen? Some monster forms give us extra abilities when we record them, beyond just being able to take their shapes. Don't panic. Achievement lock, spread your wings. Mothwing glide. You can now hold A to glide across long distances. This consumes stamina. But watch your magic Sorry. meter. <laughs> Sorry, I should have probably warned you, but I thought it might be a little easier to show you. We can use this glide to get across that gap right there. Alright, quest updated. Accompany Kaylee to the Broken Pathway. And we did naturally switch back to Kitelli. And we're fine. So yeah, we can glide. The favorite color I set up earlier is the wing color. That's all it does as far as I'm aware. I can flip this to get a shortcut back to the camp. There's an earthquake. Huh? What's going on? Is, if this is because of monster activity, we better stay sharp. Let's go. Oh, I thought there was more. Okay, you felt that one, right? Yeah, I did. The controller rumbled and everything. Hmm. The ground appears to have disappeared. What? What is that? Was this always here? This isn't normal? Never seen anything like this before. Has this always been buried here? Investigate the strange structure. Huh? Can do. Is this train station? 
This should be okay to take a look around, right? Harbor Town Station. Got a platform A here, but it's locked. We got a platform B over here. Probably. This place smells like burning metal. I can't explain it. Oh yeah, there's a B. There's treasure. Defend and some more plastic. Um, and yeah, that symbol is the multi-type symbol. Not that it matters on defend what type it is. <laughs> But it does indicate that we'll be able to equip it to a variety of creatures, if I want. I see here. Can you feel something in the air? No. And my controller rumble doesn't indicate that. <laughs> Cutscene. -y. Is that you, Mordred? Come closer, child, so that I may see you one last time. This is, this is. Uh, the long conflict has drawn to an end. I am afraid he has defeated me truly this time. Vizier, I think this is an archangel. We need to leave, now. This isn't like the other monsters. We are not safe here. And we automatically step forward. Probably the worst decision the protagonist makes, <laughs> but... Who are you? No. no, no, you are not my kin. You come for me once again, sword in hand. Oh no. Archangel Morgante, broken spirit. Coming back at you twice as greater and something something. All right. Well, use my strongest attack. <laughs> Maybe... Use my defend. So it's already severely wounded, but it's level 100. It missed, so really there's no telling how much damage it would have done. We're dealing one, even with my 60 power attack. 107. Oh hey, tutorial, Archangels. Unlike other monsters that spend AP to use moves, Archangels accumulate all their AP until it reaches 10. Once an Archangel reaches 10 AP, it unleashes all that power it wants in its unique angelic attack. To survive, use your moves strategically to either set up a solid defense in preparation or defeat the Archangel before it gets enough AP. Well, I don't have enough HP to use Elemental Wall anymore. And I don't think I'm racing it, dealing one damage at a time, so we'll see what happens. Because yeah, this costs 20% HP. It blocks three hits, but you need 20% HP. I'm not gonna die here. Not like this. Do you hear me, class here? This isn't the end for us. It can't be. I refuse! She refuses. We're gonna fight this thing and we're gonna do it together. Vysir and Kaylee's hearts act as one. Kit Lion. When your goals are aligned with those of your companion, you can fuse to become a singular, more powerful beast. More like when the fusion meter's full, but let's not worry about that. Uh, the closer you are to your companion, the more powerful you are as a fusion. Keep an eye on your fusion meter though, you can only fuse when this is full, yeah. As a fusion, you gain 4 AP each turn instead of 2, allowing you to make use of your more powerful moves sooner. You also have access to all the moves of both tapes combined, and your stats are added together. And now with... I only have a 2 AP move, I don't have a 4 AP move. Now we can probably do like 5? I didn't see the damage number. Yeah, 5. Anyway, there's its super move. It crit us for 121 and inflicted insulated because it's a glass type move. Uh, glass type attacks can limit the scope of lightning type attackers. And yeah, we were inflicted with unit target. Attacks from characters with unit target that normally target a whole team only affect a single target, and attacks that are normally single target have reduced accuracy. And yeah, the lyrics started up because we fused. 
It's the same old story. That's the name of the song, same old story. Look it up if you want. <laughs> Um, we happened to dodge enough attacks that neither character ran out of HP, but you don't actually die in that battle. Your tapes don't even break. Um, anyway, we got Wallop. We already have Zephyr, but we have a melee version of Zephyr now. Uh... How did we... I don't know. Your stamina increased by 20%. You can now glide for three seconds. Enough. My time is drawing to an end. Why have you come to this wretched place? I want a way off this island. I see. There is a way. There are none who know the path but I. I require a vessel and you require a guide. Rebuild my strength and in turn I shall lead you from this land. Oh, wait. Very well. Very well. Hear my song. If you wish to leave this land, then heed my words and hear my song. You must rise to the task at hand. You must walk the path most long. The rest of the song is too quiet to make out. <sighs> I see. Are you okay? What happened? You blanked out for a second there. We should get out of here. Hmm. A lot happened at that train station. I guess we should probably talk about it. Archangels. Not the Archangel. Archangels. Supposedly, when the first unlucky sods washed up on the shores of New World, they thought the monsters here were angels. And and some of them are of the other entities, too, greater than the others. Creatures that look and feel wrong. Logically, they called these other creatures archangels, the highest ranking among the Order of Angels. Of course, when people learned they could fight and defeat the regular monsters, they lost their angelic allure. Well... They've had a bunch of names over the years. Angels, demons, devils, ghouls. We just call them monsters now. It's a good catch-all term. <sighs> Those other creatures, though, like the one we fought, they're still archangels to us. We don't know what they are. No one has really seen one for a long time. Looking at that thing we fought, it's hard to explain. I felt like I wasn't viewing it correctly, like trying to watch a movie through binoculars or something. Sorry. No, sorry. I'm making some assumptions there. We're all from different worlds, after all. <laughs> You might not know what movies are. Uh, I do. <sighs> Ew, okay, grand. I've been in New World for three years and I've still not completely learned to adjust my cultural references when I talk to new folks. About us fusing. <laughs> oh, yeah, that. Fusion is a rare phenomenon known by the rangers. They are fused monsters in the wild and supposedly the leader of the rangers can do it too. In the right circumstances, two people in monster form are able to unite and perform one powerful being. I guess the right circumstances include nearly being killed by an archangel. It felt strange. In that moment, I was sharing a body with you, and the thing we became was both of us and not us at the same time. I, I've never fused with anyone before. I certainly wasn't expecting to fuse with someone I barely know. It just kind of happened in the heat of the moment, right? Sorry. Sorry, talking about it's a little awkward. We wouldn't have survived yeah. without it. Yeah, I guess you're right. Now that we've done it, I have this weird feeling inside me, like a door is open that I didn't know was there before. I feel like I'd be able to fuse with you again if we ever needed to. So let me get this straight. That Archangel, Morgante, her memory is inside you now? And she knows a way to leave New World? If there's even a chance that this can lead to a way off this island and return people to their homes and their families, we owe it to everyone on New World to find you out. And I. What do you say? Are we in this together? Let's do this. Boop. Fusion is now available in regular battles when partnered with Kaylee. Fusions you form with Kaylee now have 5% added strength. Uh, relationships. They do the things that were just read out. You have to rest in order to get a new heart. If an archangel gave you that vision, then you need to find another one, and you need to be strong enough to stand against it when you do. Quest complete. This is the world we live in. And the next quest, Land of Confusion, the same song reference. <laughs> uh, anyway, locate Archangels to complete Morgante's song, and then follow the clues it contains to find your new way home. The Rangers have a training program that will help you become strong enough. Let's begin by getting you a meter with uh, a meeting with the Ranger leader, <laughs> also known as a meter, apparently. She'll be in, at the outpost in the park right about now. New quest, take me on. <laughs> Head to the outpost. Um, 
Let's see. So, Dominoth doesn't really need both Zephyr and Wallop. Um, I mean, it could help if I know a monster has more uh, melee defense than ranged defense. But I'm gonna remove Wallop here. And get Dandelion an actual attack if it can fit. Or rather, if it's allowed. Yeah, Wallop. Fly sticker. And it's plant type because it's a multi type sticker. So now I don't just have to smack if I want to deal damage. Um, nothing else to do here? Let's see, it should be wrapping up soon, but let's talk to the. Bonjour. Barista? <laughs> Owner? Anyway, hello. It's not too awesome when we get a new face in here, especially not one as handsome as your own. I am Clemence. Okay, and this fine establishment is the Gramophone Cafe. What can I say? I own many records and I brew the best coffee. Not there is much competition. Please feel free to ask me any questions. I'm in no rush. What's on the menu? So you can buy items and there's no unified money. Everything's just for different materials. I will spend all of my plastic on more basic tapes. I don't have enough wheat for anything too interesting. Uh, wouldn't mind an extra rewind. They're cheap. And I will not be purchasing a respool for 30. Au revoir. Goodbye. Let's see, I can rest here for free anytime I want. I'm not just limited to the campfires, which do cost an increasing amount of wood throughout the game. Hey! Don't make me tell you again. Harbor Town won't fall to bloodsuckers. So or you bloodsuckers. So unreasonable. Uh. Roll back to the darkness you came from, or you'll have to go through me. I fought your kind before and won. Do you want a demonstration? <laughs> we shall leave for now. But in time, you shall understand that we know what is best for you all. Yeah! Tell the rest of your kind that this town is protected by Eugene. Let me know if those creeps bother you again, ma'am. And whatever you do, don't invite them into your house. That's what they want. Thank you! I'll keep that in mind. Thank you for intervening, young man. Hey! Oh, hey, sorry you had to see that. Eugene. Which I guess you know, because I just yelled it at those guys. I'm Kleisier. Always nice to meet a new face around here, Kleisier. Who were those people? <sighs> Won't trouble you with the details, but they don't belong in this world. Let's just say that not all the monsters in New World look like serial mascots. Anyway, I gotta go stake out those guys. Can't risk them sinking their teeth into the good people of Harbor Town. Can I help? <laughs> If you're willing to get your hands dirty, I'll, I'd be glad to have you assist. Meet me at this location. I'll give you the full lowdown when you're there. Acting on your best behavior. I don't recognize that song reference if it is one. Just prepare for a throwdown. Things might get kind of ugly. Kaylee has absolutely no reaction to that. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we've got three quests that are going to span basically the whole game. Uh... We have the quest with Eugene, we have the quest with the Rangers, and we have Morgante's song. I can play what we have of it so far anytime with the Y button, and we need eight more parts to have the full song. Anyway, we'll start on some of that next time. And also I'll uh, get to why I was interested in that seal monster as well. But you might be able to guess. Anyway, see ya.